Hello there, it's Lance here from Wellsbridge Motorhomes and today we have a 2007 A-Class Rapido Le Rondonaire 9097F and this is based on the Fiat Ducato 2.3 turbo diesel with the six speed gearbox. It's done just under 70 and a half thousand miles if you're wondering the length of this one, it is 7.5 meters in length, and it does have a gross weight of 3,700 kg. But this is a, a lovely model, basically it is a four berth. It has a drop down bed over your cab area, and it has a dinette area as well. In the middle with two forward facing traveling belts, so you can actually travel for people including the driver and passenger and at the back of the motorhome is a fixed transverse bed going over a garage and it is a double transverse bed and the garage is a, a nice big size large garage which you can access from either side which I'll show you as we go along so we'll start on this side of the Rapido so above the coach built body where you can see the the bar there is a TV aerial just poking its head out just there. And in this area, we have more storage, another storage locker before you get to the garage. If we come this side, you do have where your main hookup would be, the vent for your heating. It's Truma heating and it is blown air heating, which I'll show you inside. And then this is where you fill up your fresh water. So let's go to the garage. So this is the smaller access point, but it's still a good size, quite large, which you can see if I show you. Now it has got an awning on the side of the motorhome, the other side, uh, and it looks like somebody has left sides to the awning on this one inside the garage. There you go. So we'll just go to the back of the motorhome. Been fitted with a few other extras, like this tow bar here and just above the back window we have a reversing camera lens as well just there i'll just come back so you can see the back of the rapido properly okay so we'll go to the bigger access point which is taller and about the same width as the other side Again, just, just from the other side. And it looks like there, you do it does state solar controller. Cause so I haven't checked it myself, but it could very well have a solar panel on top of this motorhome as well. Uh, you have an outside shower point here, hot and cold, which is always handy. And then this is your Fiamma. I'll just come back so you can see your Fiamma canopy awning. And we do have some more access points. Well, before I get to those, I'll just show you the outlet gas point. And then you've got your toilet, which you access from here, your cassette toilet. And again, more storage in this locker as well, which you can slide outwards like this. Okay, so let's go inside the Rapido so you can see the setup. We'll start in the cab area. But just before I go on in, <clears throat> we do have a fly screen door that will shoot across the whole habitation door. Okay, so let's go to the cab area first. So you can see it has got cab air conditioning. And by the looks of this, the block point, you have potentially got Bluetooth here. Potentially, like I said, I have to double check that, but you've got phone symbols. And then it is a CD player on that one as well could very well just be auxiliary on this model uh, but going along there's your six-speed gearbox and then you do have your cruise control just here just below that stick and then you fit the car steering wheel now around the front windscreen you can see you've got built-in blinds and on the side windows so if you wanted to you can completely have it shut off if you wish to do so 
Okay, so coming back, you'll see I've already swiveled the two front seats round to make it a full dinette area, the driver and the passenger. Uh, you see it's like an L-shaped dinette. If I come back a bit, you'll be able to see. And there's sofa the other side as well, which again, that has storage underneath and another locker underneath that side. So I'll just show you from this side. Now, if you want to make it so you can travel two passengers in the back, you would have to take this cushion out, but you can do it, and that's where you would put your legs. Now, your table can be a full dining table. At the moment, it is halved, but you just turn it over, and there we have your full dining table. It covers the whole area. Okay, let's put that back. Now, with the A-classes, one impressive feat is that they have this drop-down bed coming over your cab area. It's very easy to do and I can just show you quickly. So if you bear with me, what we have to do first, we have to drop down the fronts of these seats. So bear with us. Bear with me guys. Okay. So you can see I have dropped the two front seats. This will allow the bed to come down the full distance. So undo the buckle and then pull on down. And there you go, there is your double bed over your cab area. As you can see, it's a good size, it's a full on double. And you do have a roof light up there as well. And a couple of lights actually, which you can turn on when you're up in bed. And to uh, put it back, it's very simple, you just pull on out first and then push up. And that has got to go into the clip. There we go. So we do have storage lockers going around the side. Plenty of those. Looks like you've got a very large garage, so I should think you'd be utilising that space more than anything. Um, but as we come in the habitation door, straight to your left, you do have a large fridge and separate freezer, a Dometic, just to show you inside the freezer, and then I can show you inside your fridge as well. There we are. We'll just lock that back into place. <clears throat> now the opposite side is your kitchen area. We have some storage here. As I say, you're blowing a heating vents going around the motorhome. We'll start with your kitchen sink. So you just take this out and there's your kitchen sink. You just put it back in, simple as that. There we go. And then we have your free burner gas hob. And then we do have a Smev grill, I believe just below your worktop space in the kitchen. So just coming into the back area, again, this is your large wardrobe. Just so you can see the depth of that. The opposite side to that wardrobe, like I say, your washroom in this, you've got your shower separate to your um, toilet area and this is your fet for cassette toilet and you got nice storage lockers here three of them and then over here we have your wash basin again more storage in here on the opposite side you have your shower before getting into the bedroom okay so this is your transverse double bed over your garage. Plenty of storage wrapping round once again. Nice big windows, bringing a lot of light in. And then you've got two big steps going up into your bedroom. And so it's a, 
a large double just like the one at the front and you can access it from the inside the garage actually on this and the, the previous owners have obviously put a couple, a couple of bins here but yes um, so if you want to subscribe to our YouTube channel you can hit the subscribe button just below and keep up to date with all the latest videos that we will be posting here you can also in the description there will be information to call the sales team you can call us on 01487812511 or alternatively 01487812901 and you can go to the website which the link will be in the youtube description once again and you can email us through there if you want to email and look at all our stock that we have on there i mean there will be a link to this actual motorhome as well in the description so if you want to view this in more detail you can do so at your own leisure and from the website you can go to the on the home page to the top right hand corner and you can follow our facebook and instagram pages as well if you want to keep right up to date okay thank you